and now there is a push to give workers paid sick leave. News 3 reporter Brendan Ponton has a look at the debate. The final details of the legislation are still being worked out, but there is some pushback now from members of the business community. Virginia state lawmakers are taking up some very important issues during their special session beginning tomorrow. The special session is brought on because of a need. And so a lot of the need that has been shown because of the pandemic shows that we do need some pretty big changes. Newport News Democratic Delegate Marcia Price wants to add paid sick leave to those changes. The bill has not been filed yet, but it would require employers to give five sick days a year to full-time employees and two weeks of paid leave if they get COVID-19 or have to quarantine. I definitely think that before the pandemic, we needed paid sick leave. People need to be able to be sick and go home and heal. Uh, to make the others that they work with safe, but then for their own safety. But some are worried small businesses could be hit hard. Kate Baker from the Virginia Retail Federation wants to see more of the details. These type of things impact businesses, especially our small members, hard financially, and they need flexibility to deal with issues. In March, Congress passed provisions giving sick leave to people with COVID-19, but this proposal would go beyond that. They care about their employees and want to do whatever they can for them. But when you mandate a one size fits all program, it's really hard for businesses to adapt, especially in today's economic climate. A climate that's gotten a whole lot tougher during the pandemic as now state lawmakers try to come up with some solutions. In Norfolk, Brendan Ponton, News 3.